Hi, my name is Sharon Freeman and I am the proud mother of Melvin Freeman Jr. Melvin passed away August 5th of 2015. And it actually took me a while to join the Compassionate Friends group. I was a type of person that really did not believe in groups. And so I didn't want to join the group. I'm, I was also the kind of person that said, I can do this on my own. I'm tough. I'm in control. I can do this without a support group. And um, as I always say, how well did that work for me? Not very well at all. Melvin had, Melvin Jr. Um, actually passed away suddenly uh, from an, um, a lung uh, bilateral uh, embolism. And so it was sudden. And um, for somebody who's in control and thinks they can plan everything and take care of everything and protect everyone, um, August, 5th of 2015 was the worst day in my life. But finding compassionate friends was one of the best days in my life. I remember walking in and I walked in and it was actually a snowy day and there were two of us and we walked in and, and walking in, remember, I thought I could do this on my own walking in with one other person and putting and going in and actually the because it was a snowy day it was canceled then i thought i'm never coming back again again i don't need this is a sign i don't need a support group so i walked in you know again and and haven't stopped um going. I have met people who get it, as I call it, who understand the um, losing a uh, losing a child um, and being able to laugh and cry with you. Not that you ever wanted to find a support group that had people that were like you, but this group in regards to helping you find your joy, understanding when you cried, what you're crying for, sometimes not even saying anything, just being there, or sometimes, as I say, saying something and it comforts someone else. So the, this is just some of the wonderful things that this support group uh, has, has helped me in being um, around people that get it and that get me. And that I don't have to explain when tears roll down my eyes or why is she laughing at a time like this? It is just one of the best things that I have done for myself and through my grieving process and will continue to, um, to just be a part of this organization. So thank you, compassionate friends, for helping me find my joy and my peace when I never thought I could. Mm -hmm.